and welcome back to Audio Inside Scoop. Now, you may be wondering why I'm on the floor today as opposed to over at the desk. Well, today I'm going to do something a little bit different, something I have incredibly mixed feelings about and something I absolutely had no plan to ever do because there are so many variables that cannot be accounted for. There are so many things that make this an unreliable method for your viewing and for your listening, but I did say that I was here for you guys and I meant it. I said that if you guys wanted something, I'd make it happen. I had so many requests and so many of you wanted to see this, so let's do it. Today I'm going to start a segment called Here With Me, you know, because it's like you're here with me, you can hear the speakers with me, you get the idea. Anyways, I'll mic up the speakers and provide listening samples. I'm going to start with the Clip versus the Austin, then rock out the Nashville versus the Flip, and then as I move forward, I'll do these compares on every side-by-side -side review that I do. Most likely as a separate video, but we'll see how this goes. We're going to jump into this here in a minute, but before I do, I want to do a quick overview of why I'm a little bit hesitant to do this and why I feel like you guys should still hear these speakers in person before ultimately making your purchase decision. Here we go. Now there's always going to be variables, even when you are in the room with the speakers. Basically when we listen in person we have an audio source, which on these types of speakers is generally a phone or a tablet. It's then connected over Bluetooth or auxiliary cable and plays audio to your device. Then we hear it through our ears. The primary variables being the room, the means of connection, and the source. And I guess your ears if you want to get that deep into it, but when we try to recreate this for video purposes, we add in a ton of unwelcomed additional variables. First off, instead of the audio going straight in your ears, it's going to go into a microphone, which will color the sound a bit on its own. Next, we import this track onto the computer, edit it, render out a video, and then it's uploaded to various streaming platforms, each of which is going to handle the video and audio a bit differently. In this process, the audio track will have been compressed several times before reaching your phone or your computer or, you know, whatever you're watching it on, which is actually the final huge variable I'm going to discuss. Whatever you're listening on will color the sound as well. Are you listening on headphones? What headphones? Are you watching through your TV? On a soundbar? Home theater system? What are the makes and models of your speakers? This video will sound completely different depending on what you're using for your playback. Now, I say all of that to say this. Watch this video but take it with a grain of salt. Many in-person stores where you can buy these have listening stations where you can actually hear these side by side. Go do that. I know we all want to decide through videos, order online, and have it delivered directly to our doors. I'm guilty of this as well, but for something like this, you're gonna wanna hear it before you buy it if possible. One more thing that I want to notate here is that if I'm gonna do this, I'm gonna do it a little bit different than others that you've seen in the past. A lot of these I see recorded on a phone at the same undetermined random distance, and you get what you get. Now I'm not hating on these guys, these still are solid because they're equal distances apart from each other because they're recorded side by side, but I thought I could improve upon this process just a bit. I'm actually going to shoot one at a time, and whenever I do these tests, I plan to do them identically. Same six tracks, which I know you guys may get bored with these, but it'll allow for equal compares across the board. Also, a lot of you guys are going to say, get tracks that we all know and love, but sorry, I can't do that either for licensing reasons. These will all be tracks that I've purchased the rights to or I have permissions to use. Now, as for track selections, I've tried to make this as diverse as possible without making these videos seven hours long. That said, I have divided these videos with chapters, so if you hate a track, skip over it and find the one you like for comparing. We'll have the same mic, same room, same distance between mic and speakers, and same everything. There will obviously still be some variables that make this imperfect, but I'll minimize these as much as possible. With this method, if you're watching to compare two speakers that I've worked with but haven't put head-to-head, -head, you can bounce back and forth between the videos, or I can remix a set of videos to accommodate that as well. Now, let's take a look at the setup. This mark right here is going to be the face of the speakers. This mark is going to be the tip of the microphone, and they are 1 meter or 3.28 feet apart. Both spike marks will be left under my rug, so never to be moved, to keep this accurate throughout every video we make going forward. I've also added the meter into the mix, so you can get a visual representation there as well. In editing, if boosting is needed, I'll boost each video identically and let you guys know how much I boosted it in the, in the description. And last but not least, I'll run through each song three times at 50%, 70%, and 100% volume. Okay, sorry about that guys, soapbox moment over. I would not feel right making these videos without first putting that little kind of disclaimer out there. So, on to side-by-side -side compares. This is gonna be the first of many of these. We will also have tons more review style compares releasing soon, so if you're enjoying this content, please hit that like and subscribe button below. It helps immensely and is greatly appreciated. 
Also, if you click the little bell next to it as well, it'll notify you as soon as new videos drop. And now the moment you guys have all been waiting for, as I said before, this is the Klipsch Austin versus the JBL clip. Let's go. I've said this a million times You're no good for me I said say goodbye But your voice is my lullaby And your kisses are something I can't deny Is it right? Is it wrong? I don't care It feels way too good Is it right? Is it wrong? Your lips heal me when I feel blue Some days I say you're the one I hate
Yes. 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 It's the Legion. Skip Once again, I'm on my grind, cause my knees always on my mind, and they don't wanna see me shine. I know. Let's go. Haters gonna hate me, you can go ahead and hate me. Ain't no way you're gonna try to take my glow. Yes, I'm double O selling in the paper. Can't let a super man in my spaceship. They don't wanna see me shining when they hate that. They don't wanna see me shine when they hate that. I'm double O selling in the paper. Can't let a super man in my spaceship. They don't wanna see me shining when they hate that. They don't wanna see me shine when they hate that. Took a lot coming from the bottom. Yes. They was like, Thony, yo, you such a problem. Yes. You so Medusa, you looking, you got it. Yes. Suck like stone, yes. see how you got it. Yes. Yes. Don't let it go to your head. Uh. Don't let it get to you, dog. They don't even know what you've been through before. Or who was in your corner when you were still broke. Kill, 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 kill them all, the killer will kill them all. I'ma treat it like a fruit, I'm willing to peel them all. Killing it, peeling off, I'm feeling it, willing off. They be saying they the realest, but really ain't real enough. Nah. My day to day is loco, it's never so so. I'm an entrepreneur with the brain work. Yes. I gotta get it from a seat, I'm a fan, gotta eat. Day to day, I'm trying to learn how the game works. I mean a pissed off kid that I call your bluff I was a pissed off kid before I even really knew what it meant We either take all or nothing yes. Once again I'm on my grind cause my knees always on my mind And they don't wanna see me shine I know Let's go Yes Haters gonna hate me you can go ahead and hate me Ain't no way you're gonna try to take my glow Yes I'm yes. double no selling yes. in the paper Can't let it with the man in my spaceship They don't wanna see me shine when they hate that They don't wanna see me shine when they hate that I'm double no selling in the paper Like the pop roll lights, uh, like the club show lights. Uh, niggas wanna steal my shine, but they cannot do it like me. They cannot do it like you. Can a nigga out like VE, make cake like Lil Debbie, rock a Lil Bezzy and get my fam out the fucking hood. God damn, they hate you ain't doing good. But love when you at the bottom, deal it in robbing. Don't want through problem, at the problem. Like the problem should be your problem. See the problem, they ain't popping. So I hop them with no option, cause my opportunity locked in. Make mills like John Stockton. That's him, but yeah, he never broke again. I remember not in like the old Twins, trying to look up for these so-called friends yeah. All the so-called came to an end And I will never pick them up again Nope, I just won't Look how me and throw your flow After we cut ties to those ropes We ghost, nigga, let's go Once again, I'm on my grind Cause my knees always on my mind And they don't wanna see me shine, I know Let's go Haters gonna hate me, you can go ahead and hate me Ain't no way you're gonna try to take my glow Yes, I'm double O setting in the paper Can't let it with the man in my spaceship They don't wanna see me shining when they hate that They don't wanna see me shining when they hate that I'm double O setting in the paper Can't let it with the man in my spaceship They don't wanna see me shining when they hate that They don't wanna see me shining when they hate that Just annoying anyway Why must I think this way I'm an overthinker An overthinker I overthink her oh, I overthink her I can't stop thinking of
There it is. Now I gave you my thoughts in the review style video. Check that one out if you haven't seen it yet. As for this one though, tell me your thoughts. Do you like this style video? Want me to keep them coming? What do you guys think of the speakers themselves? Tell me all about it in the comments below. That's going to be about all I have for you guys today. Please make sure you hit that like and subscribe button below and we'll see you again soon for another episode of Audio Inside Scoop.